EA Sports. It's in the game. All right, Coach, EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to the Sunshine State in TIAA Bank Field here in Jacksonville. This crowd excited to see their Jaguars as both teams emerge from their tunnels a moment ago. We are just about ready for football as the Jags get set to match up with the Atlanta Falcons. Here's Bosher to kick it away. And that drives coaches insane, doesn't it? When they see that happen, it just, it just doesn't feel right, does it? Plus, you're giving up yardage. First and ten, here's Bortles. That one complete to D.D. Westbrook. 
And he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. A very solid gain of 27. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. Green 80. Green 80. Green 80. Bortles now on first down. He couldn't quite hold it. Got hit. Ball pops out. Incomplete. That would have been a great catch, but it's real difficult to hold on to it because it was contested all the way. Would have been a great play if he had been able to haul that one in. Second and 10 from the 33-yard line. Bortles will try again on second down. And the reception made by Dante Moncrief. And they'll be inside the 25 now at the 24. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets them up for third down. The last catch nearly got him a first, but it did not, and they'll try to convert on third and inches. Bortles will keep it, and he'll be touched out here, but not before he does pick up the first. Only a yard there on the keeper, but that's all he needed, first down. There may have been a little bit of an element of surprise there. Third and inches, and they go quarterback sneak. I still feel like this is a play that often is reserved for fourth down. This is T.J. Yeldon, and down inside the 15, shy of the 10. The Jags picking up the first down there, a gain of 12. Quite the opening drive march they're on right now. It looks a lot like what we saw in practice prior to the game, doesn't it? You know, because on that last big practice beforehand, you go through your offensive script, you go through your play calling, you go through all the stuff and establish things, and it looks like it's going like clockwork right now for them. The Jags with their first opportunity in the red zone. It's first and 10 from the 12. Green 80. Working from the gun, it's Bortles. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. They get 10 more there, and I believe that'll be enough for another first down at will. Well, he did everything but get him in the end zone there, but now they're set up golden opportunity. Strong opening drive, and they're knocking on the door. And the way that they did it, now look where they are on the field, all right? This is naturally set up for a running play, isn't it? But with his ability to throw the football, his accuracy on this drive, you might want to think about a pass play in this situation. Mm, interesting. Time to find out. 87, 77. Move. They'll try to punch it in with Fournette. That's going to go as a loss of a yard, and it'll be second down. That almost felt like the defense said he is not getting in. What a play. Not only stopping him at the line, but pushing him back a yard as well. So they're backed up to the three-yard line, second and goal. Green 80. Green 80. 
272. From the gun, it's Bortles. And he can't corral it. Maybe a big missed opportunity there defensively in the end zone. And now third down. They may be snapping the ball near the goal line, but all you're thinking defensively, keep them out of the end zone. Force the incompletion, force them into going for three and not giving up six. So it's third and goal, and now the question, can this Falcon defense stand tall once more? Set. Green 80. They'll try to punch it in with Yeldon. And he's going to be stopped up right at the line of scrimmage. What a stand so far defensively. And now that's going to bring up a fourth and goal. On is Josh Lambeau now for the Jaguar field goal. From the right hash at a bit of a tight angle. And Lambeau will put this one through. And the Jaguars grab a 3-0 lead. So a pretty good opening drive. That'll make the home fans somewhat happy. They wanted six, but they got three in the early lead. And they should be happy. The guys look good getting down the field. That's got to give them.